See you, love. Love Bye. you. Bye. My name's Tim Atkin. Uh, I live in Scarborough, North Yorkshire. My background was in the textile business. I actually had a, a, a shop and a series of market stalls selling ladies' clothing. In the 80s and up to the early 90s, this became quite a profitable business. It afforded us a, a good living. But the recession kicked in in the early 90s. Oh yeah, you all right? Snap-on originally interested me because uh, it offered a, an opportunity to be uh, self-employed. Uh, I knew it was a, a premium brand. Uh, I knew that uh, it was a good product which would uh, give you a serious edge over the competition due to its brand strength. I had no technical experience, I had no garage experience, no motor trade experience of any kind. The, the one thing I had going for me really was my business experience. Have a look on. Yeah, good one, yeah. yeah. If you can build a relationship with your customer, then you're halfway there. You need to go in there, talk to customers, entice them on the van, which they want you to do. They like you to sell to them. You are often the highlight of their day. No matter what they make out of you and whatever they say that you do or don't do, they're always queuing up to come and see you the following week. The training that I received has been critical to the success of this business and that is ongoing. If you need any help in any aspect of the business, whether it be collecting money off an awkward customer or um, fixing a product which is a little bit beyond your capability, the manager or whoever you need is there to help. The stud's frozen in or whatever, this will get it out. It won't damage anything around it because the heat's localised. My family have been instrumental in the business, particularly Sandra, my wife. Sa Sandra is always doing the banking for me, which takes a big chunk of the day up if I do it myself. Well, I'm always on call if Tim wants me to deliver anything or pick anything up or exchange a box. Uh, I do banking, I do some of the paperwork. He couldn't manage without me. You need to try and make yourself uh, the, no the number one stop or number one shop for your customer. And if you give him a good service, then that is going to, de that is going to develop. Definitely I would recommend a snap-on franchise to other people. Uh, again, if you uh, are prepared to work uh, Monday to Friday from nine till five, then this is not for you. But if you don't mind putting the hours in, and they could be long, you will definitely re reap the rewards in this business. <laughs>